Have you ever wondered how long it would take to reach the nearest planet to the Sun, Mercury, using our fastest spaceship? In this cosmic journey, we'll traverse the grand expanse of the solar system, starting with Mercury. A mere 55 million kilometers from Earth, our fastest spaceship would take approximately three months to reach this sweltering planet. A world shrouded in mystery where a single day lasts longer than its year. Join us as we delve into the mysteries of Mercury. Mercury, the smallest planet in our solar system, has a lot to offer. This tiny celestial body, nestled closest to the Sun, is a world of extremes. It experiences scorching daytime temperatures that can reach 800 degrees Fahrenheit, yet at night the temperature plummets to a chilling minus 290 degrees. A stark contrast, wouldn't you agree? Mercury's atmosphere, or rather its lack thereof, is another intriguing aspect. It's so thin that it's almost non-existent, causing the sun's rays to beat directly onto the planet's surface and leading to its dramatic temperature swings. And let's not forget about Mercury's molten core. Unlike the solid cores of other small planets, Mercury's core is still fiery and alive, accounting for a staggering 75% of the planet's diameter. Despite being the smallest, Mercury holds its own unique mysteries. It's a testament to the fact that size doesn't always dictate the intrigue or the significance of a planet. Next in line, Venus, the brightest object in our sky after the Sun and the Moon. This dazzling planet, often mistaken for a star, is a spectacle to behold. Yet don't be fooled by its radiant glow. Venus is a world of extremes. Venus is a unique character on the solar system stage. It spins in a direction opposite to most other planets, a phenomenon known as retrograde rotation. This peculiar rotation makes a day on Venus longer than its year. Imagine that. Now let's delve into its atmosphere a thick, toxic blanket composed mostly of carbon dioxide with clouds of sulfuric acid. This dense atmosphere creates a greenhouse effect, trapping heat and making Venus the hottest planet in our solar system, even hotter than Mercury, which is closer to the Sun. Venus, a bright beacon in our sky, yet holds so many secrets. As we continue our journey, let us marvel at the mysteries that Venus, the brightest planet, presents to us. Before we move further, let's take a moment to appreciate our home, Earth. A vibrant blue sphere, the third rock from the Sun, Earth is unique. Its nickname, the Blue Marble, reflects its water-abundant surface. This water, existing in solid, liquid and gas states, is what sets Earth apart from other celestial bodies. This diverse state of water is pivotal for life. It's seen from the polar ice caps to the steam of a boiling kettle to the water we drink daily. Earth is a dynamic sphere hosting numerous ecosystems, each carrying a delicate balance of life forms, from the microscopic marine creatures to the extensive herds of wildebeest in Africa, life on Earth is incredibly diverse. Earth, our home, a beacon of life in the vast cosmos. As we continue our journey, remember every planet we visit makes us appreciate our home more. Our neighbouring planet, Mars, the red planet, has intrigued us for centuries. Mars, with its fiery, ruddy hue, has earned its nickname due to the iron oxide or rust that dusts its surface. Its captivating colour is not its only intriguing quality. Mars also holds the potential for water, a critical component for life as we know it. While the surface today is dry and barren, evidence suggests that in the past, water may have flowed across the Martian landscape. Could this hint at a past life on Mars? The mysteries deepen. Mars also boasts the largest volcano in our solar system, Olympus Mons, standing almost three times the height of Mount Everest. It's a silent testament to the planet's tumultuous geological past. A voyage to Mars with current technology would take about nine months, a testament to its relatively close proximity. Mars, a planet of extremes, continues to spark our curiosity. Journeying further, we encounter the gas giants, Jupiter and Saturn. These celestial titans are the largest planets in our solar system, dwarfing our home world in size and scale. Their colossal stature is a testament to their immense gravitational pull, a force so powerful that it has ensnared countless moons in their orbits. Jupiter, the larger of the two, boasts a staggering 67 moons, while Saturn, not to be outdone, has a confirmed count of 62. 
Let's delve deeper into these behemoths. Jupiter, the fifth planet from the Sun, is a world of storms. Its most famous feature, the Great Red Spot, is a storm that has been raging for at least 300 years. The sheer size of this storm is mind-boggling, as it is twice the size of Earth. Jupiter's composition, primarily hydrogen and helium, is similar to that of the Sun, leading some to refer to it as a failed star. Now imagine a journey of approximately 600 million miles from Jupiter and you'd find yourself at Saturn, the sixth planet from the Sun. Saturn is perhaps best known for its stunning rings. These rings, primarily composed of ice particles with a smattering of rocky debris and dust, stretch out over 200,000 miles into space, but are surprisingly thin, measuring less than a mile in thickness. Saturn's largest moon, Titan, is bigger than the planet Mercury and is the only moon in our solar system to have a substantial atmosphere. As we journey from Earth, it would take us about six years to reach Jupiter and another three to reach Saturn, traveling at the speed of the fastest spacecraft built by humankind. This vast distance underscores the enormity of our solar system and the challenges we face in exploring it. The gas giants, a spectacle of size and beauty, are a testament to the mysteries of our solar system. Beyond the gas giants, we find the icy worlds of Uranus and Neptune. These celestial bodies cloaked in shades of blue are the most distant planets in our solar system that can be seen with the naked eye. Uranus, the seventh planet from the sun, is unique for its unusual tilt. Unlike the other planets, which spin on an axis almost perpendicular to their orbit, Uranus rotates on its side. This axial tilt, a staggering 98 degrees, is thought to be the result of a colossal impact with another celestial body in the distant past. This side-on rotation results in extreme seasons, with each pole experiencing 21 years of continuous sunlight followed by 21 years of darkness. While Uranus is a peculiar world, its sibling Neptune is no less intriguing. Neptune, the eighth and farthest known planet from the Sun is renowned for its tumultuous weather. Winds whip around the planet at speeds up to 2,000 kilometers per hour, the fastest planetary winds detected so far. Both Uranus and Neptune are often referred to as ice giants, a fitting name for these frigid worlds, while the term ice in ice giant refers to substances like water, ammonia and methane. It's not ice as we know it. In the extreme pressures and temperatures of these planets, these substances form a hot, dense fluid that behaves in strange and unfamiliar ways. This fluid is thought to give rise to the intense magnetic fields of both planets. The journey to these icy worlds is not a short one. Traveling at the speed of the fastest spaceship powered by current technology, it would take approximately nine years to reach Uranus and 12 years to reach Neptune. Uranus and Neptune, the icy twins, keep their secrets well guarded. But with every new discovery, we come one step closer to understanding the mysteries of these distant frozen giants. Finally, we reach the outskirts of our solar system to the dwarf planet Pluto, a celestial body that has sparked much debate among astronomers and has captured the imaginations of many. Once considered the ninth planet from the Sun, Pluto was reclassified as a dwarf planet in 2006. This decision by the International Astronomical Union was based on the newly established criteria for planet classification, a move that sparked widespread discussion. Pluto is a world of many wonders, one of which is its heart-shaped glacier, known as Tombaugh Regio. This distinctive heart-shaped region, named after Clyde Tombaugh, the discoverer of Pluto, is a vast plain of nitrogen, carbon monoxide and methane ices. It's a surface feature that stands out in stark contrast to the otherwise rugged and cratered terrain that surrounds it. Sharing Pluto's orbit is Charon, its largest moon. Charon is so large in relation to Pluto that some consider the pair a binary system. They are locked in a gravitational dance, each facing the other with the same side, much like our own moon does with Earth. Pluto, with its icy heart and its moon, Charon, stands as a testament to the diversity and mystery of our solar system. It is a world that challenges our understanding of what a planet can be. 
Pluto, the little planet on the edge of our solar system, is a reminder of the vastness of space. Our journey through the solar system brings us back to a thought-provoking question. As we've traversed from the fiery furnace of Mercury to the icy realms of Pluto, we've witnessed an array of celestial wonders, each with its unique mysteries. We've traveled millions of miles, yet we've only scratched the surface of what lies within our own cosmic backyard. With all the mysteries that each planet holds, how much more is there to discover beyond our solar system?